Hi everyone, welcome back. I have a parcel here from a new to me shop called Zeta Florence. It's very well packaged uh, and I thought I would share it with you because that's what I do, right? So let's dive in. Well, how pretty is this paper? <laughs> so um, the gentleman who runs the store phoned me and asked me just a couple of questions he had about my order. And he said, what color wrapping paper would you like? And I said, pink, and he has done that. So it's beautiful. Um, it's got a little Zeta Florence logo on the back there. And um, so I just chose the gift wrapping option because I want to open it with you. I just think it's pretty. And also I love wrapping paper. I love using it. And this is like proper paper paper. It's not the plasticky paper that most gift wrap is. And I just got him to um, write my name on a card. I wanted to see what his writing was like. I don't know if that's silly, but I just thought it would be cute to see what his writing was like. So that's the little card that came with it. And then here is the package itself. So let's dive in. Oh, it's stuck down. There's no tape. Oh, I like that. Okay. There we go. And it's stuck to the box as well. <laughs> okay. Let's put the paper to the side. And hopefully you can see here, this is a, a sealing wax kit. Let's have a look, hey? okay wow that's beautiful what a gorgeous box and i also got this card as well so tons of packaging in this order let's start with the card i just picked up this magnolia print sometimes you can get free shipping if you just go a little bit extra and so um you know you can spend the money on shipping or you can spend the money on products so i almost always will spend it on products if there's something there that i like and I really loved this card. It is their own brand, which I did not know. It says Zeta Florence on the back there, established 1989. This card is designed and printed locally in Melbourne. The quality of the paper is just divine. It's like a very thick card. And I just love this pink magnolia print. It's just the perfect pink, right? It's gorgeous. So pretty. And I thought I can use that in my journals or um, as a dashboard so there's that but the start of the show is this little box and again it's just beautifully packaged so I'm just going to undo the ribbon and we'll dive in and see what's in here okay here we go all right so it has this little magnetic closure on the front there and then inside oh, everything has moved around a little in transit so let's pop them all back in their spots okay so let me tell you about what's in here we have um this little polishing cloth uh has come with it it's very cute and i have um the stamp here it's a solid brass stamp i'll show you in a second and then i have four um four of the waxes as well so these are wicked waxes so i'll just take this gold one for example and you can see there's a little wick on the end so i can light this and then drip the wax onto my paper and then pop the stamp in so here is the stamp um it's a rosewood handle which is the standard handle i think it came with you could choose other types uh, it has that of florence on it and then the stamp that i chose is a lilac flower and hopefully you can see that there i'm not actually going to do this today i'm not quite prepared um i want to give it a go i think first um but i just wanted to show you what has popped in the mail because i think it's just beautiful when i when we found it online i just thought yeah this is pretty cute and i've always wanted to try um some wax seals i've gotten a couple in orders and i think in journaling it's just going to look really beautiful okay so the colors that i have are uh, this is called velvet plum this is called coral it doesn't really look like coral but that's what it's called this one is rose gold and this one is gold so i just think they're beautiful and are going to just give me a little something extra to add to my journal so um this is what i'm currently journaling in it's my hobonichi uh, rose tweed cover and inside I have the um, English let me just flick to an empty spread the English um, A6 Techo and just to give you an idea of some of the 
I mean, I've just been doing some fairly standard journaling in here, but I have started journaling in a week instead, and I'm thinking that I don't want to go to the trouble of transferring the information across here, which is what I had planned to do originally. So instead, I thought I might do more creative things like this. This is some stamping that I did um, a while back in the end of January. And I'm thinking what I might do moving forward um, is, you know, it's a bit more creative journaling in here instead. I was going to make this the place that I kept the actual words, but I obviously will do some journaling in here. Like some, I'll put some snippets of the day or whatever in here, but I think predominantly that's going to stay in my weeks and I'm going to do some creative stuff in the journal instead. So already it's March and I've changed up a couple of things in my planning system actually I might take you through it again in, in um, a video in the future uh, as I settle back into the next the new plan not too dramatic uh, most things have stayed the same but I've changed a couple things up so I'm very excited to try this out this really pretty lilac stamp there, there's so many different stamps you could choose from and I might if you know if I love this I might go back and get another couple uh, there was a little happy mail one that I really loved and I almost got that one but I just thought the flower looked so pretty. So yes, I'm super excited to try this out. I think the gold is beautiful and is this velvet plum, but looking at the others, um, they also looked really lovely. So I kind of wanted a pink, as you can probably imagine, <laughs> I kind of wanted a pinkish set. So that's what I've ended up with here. Uh, and yeah, I might look into more if I'm, if I find this to be something that I like to do in the journal or anywhere else. Um, on Happy Mail and things like that as well. So thanks so much to Zeta Florence for packaging this so beautifully. I really think it's gorgeously done. And yeah, I'm very happy to have got this in the mail so quickly. So this is a Melbourne based store. They're in Brunswick. Uh, sorry, Fitzroy, I think. Uh, anyway, very, very um, close by to each other. So not too far from here. And yeah, I think it was, I think they say on their website, they ship the next day. So it probably took about three days to get here with the current climate of um, postage. So yes, very happy. Thank you so much. Uh, quick one today. Um, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, let me know um, if you already do wax seals like this. Um, I'm intrigued to hear. I'm slightly nervous to give it a go because, you know, fire. But, <laughs> but um, not that nervous, trust me. Um, but anyway, I will uh, show you me using this uh, in, the, in the next couple of weeks, um, I'm sure. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you all again super, super soon. Bye.